All right, so the combination should be. It won't budge. What two six one two? It won't budge. Where the hell's the safe? It won't budge. An old chest of drawers. It won't budge. So none of these will open. No. It won't budge. So we gotta go to. He gave me the key, right? We're gonna go to his store and then open the safe. Should be two six one two. I gotta go all the way back now through the poorhouse, right? It won't budge. Or not. It won't open. They won't let me back into the poorhouse, so where do I go? <clears throat> it won't open. Huh. Maybe down this way, maybe they cleared it. Yup. Jack, Jack. Oh, thank God I found you. Waite's been arrested for the murder of his daughter. I know. It's my fault, Rebecca. What are you talking about, Jack? What's your fault? I had sex with his there wife. There was something in the attic. Some kind of animal, and I let it loose. It's all my fault. The police drag Waite's off. He can't take the fall for this. He's done nothing wrong. We gotta do something. Guilty or not, the Order will see him lynched for it. There's nothing you can do. Oh, you must have taken quite a bang in there, Jack. Your head's bleeding. Yeah, I think I was out of it for a little while. I see you've got some bandages. Use them on your head. It'll help you heal. You're not losing too much blood. You won't need a suture. Thanks, Rebecca. Okay. Uh, I can't use anything here. Look at all the blood all over the freaking alley. <clears throat> okay. What the? Uh oh. Don't tell me it crashed. It fucking crashed, dude. Oh, okay, I'm froze. Oh, I was in that alley that the cop was blocking. Here we go. Nice. It's unlocked. First aid kit. You don't look like your standard Whoa. crook, sweetheart. Who is she? Jesus, you crazy sap! Who the hell are you? Jack Walters, private detective. And considering your recent break in and entering, mm -hmm. how about I ask the questions? Have you any idea who I am? No, and I really don't care. My family has influential contacts in the Order, so I'd advise you to mind your manners, sir. <laughs> I'm from out of town. Take her the, the order doesn't hold much sway with me. Really? Out of town, you say? How interesting. I'm Ruth. Ruth Billingham. Huh. You're Brian's broad. That figures. Brian? Uh, I don't believe I know a Brian. Yeah, right. I've been fed that line a thousand times, and for much better liars than you. <laughs> Look, Ruth. The rumor around town is that your lover boy is in the hands of the order. What? No, that's not true. They'll have him killed. It was all my idea. I just wanted a clean break from here. What do you want me to do? I don't know. You're the detective. You think of something. I'll be waiting out at the old fishing cannery the next two nights, just past the abandoned railway station to rally. Oh. <laughs> when you find him, give him this. He'll know it's from me. Okay. Two. Six. One. Two. Didn't work. 
Fuck. I don't know what to do. I can't even stop using the combination. Two. <sighs> Fuck. How do you reset it? <sighs> Two. <sighs> now, see, this is... I don't remember how to use the combination lock. Two. Six. One. Two. There we go. Yes, Got it. Yes, that's it. The safe holds a heavily bound manuscript. The front is embossed with the words, Book of Dagon. Okay. Oh, I can't read it. <clears throat> we can save. Yep. You got the Book of Dagon. Anything else in here? Well, let me move the ladder. Various meats. It won't budge. Alright, so I guess we leave. <sighs> Wallpaper's coming off all the walls. It's getting late. I better start making tracks. I don't much fancy spending the night in this hole. All right, where am I going now? I don't know where to go now. I guess I'll, keep, I'll go out near the docks or something. See if anything happens. Oh, they won't let me. Constable, what's with the blockade? You're better be minding your own affairs. What have you done with Tom Waite? Them police affairs has nothing to warrant your concern. Chit chat to him's gonna get me no place fast. <sighs> so this didn't work. Shit. <sighs> Hit him with the Book of Dagon right in the face. <clears throat> Where I just came from. It won't open. It won't budge. Nothing new over here. That's where I came from here. I don't think I'm supposed to go there. I don't know what to do. Shit. It's a variety store, and it's closed. No Cam Jersey. I do not like Monster Energy drinks. I don't like the flavor. It's probably the, the wife monster you let Did out. Did you hear Wife killed it? Ah, oh, shit, I interrupted it. I should leave him alone. He's in no mood for talking. Do you have board for the night? We've plenty on the top floor of the house. Nice views over the town, I'm told. What the fuck? Great. The, that sounds just swell. Uh... Hey, uh, you all right there, sir? You're starting to look kind of funny there for a while. Face as white as bone and eyes as black as coal. Like you'd seen a ghost or something. I'm fine, thanks. It's just the sea air around these parts. It makes me queasy. <laughs> the Innsmouth's breeze is not for your outsiders. Charlie, can you come with me? I need to be telling you something. Perfectly. Excuse me, sir. The Innsmouth law doesn't like to be kept hanging about. I'll be right back with you shortly. Now we're to snoop, right? Grab the key and go snoop around. It's the key. 
key to the back office. It won't open. Here's the back office. It's unlocked. Whoa. The ha I wonder what secrets this book holds. The hatch is covered in blood, and I think it's an eyeball. <laughs> Here it is. She were a lively one, and no mistake. I kept her going as long as I could for the music she were making. Such a pair of lungs. After she were done, I found those lungs on her book, on her look, as good as they sounded. Maybe I'll keep them. Her liver was particular as sweet as well. I never much wanted to go to New York, but if they talk as much as this one, I reckon I ain't missing much. As soon as he woke and saw the knives, he was away taking, talking and pleading and bargaining for his life. All them words made him dizzy, and I had to take his tongue first to stop him. In future, I better wait while, while after they eaten dinner, for his inner stank awful. The bones were nearly all out before he died. I was real careful around the artery so as he didn't lose any more blood that could be helped, and he lasted a lot longer for it. The flesh moved on its own, and he tried to work his arm, but with bones gone, there wasn't nothing he could do, just twitch. I took out the strap so it looked more free, and I watched. The new gag worked much better, and it was more quiet than the last. What the fuck? <clears throat> okay, then. Sounds great. Look. There are severed body parts strewn all over the office. <laughs> okay then. If you just follow me, sir, I'll show you to your lodgings. I heard there was a killing over the old Waits house tonight. They reckon the old fool killed his own daughter. Caked head to toe in her blood, they says, and had to be dragged away, screaming and crying. I reckon there'll be a lynching for what he done. Weird. Huh. <laughs> This is the room for the night. You're still looking pallid, sir. You're needing to have yourself some rest. Sleep well. And keep down the racket. Us Innsmouth are quiet yeah. fall. Shout out to your boy Bob who did a 50 years and happy Halloween. Okay. Nothing of interest. Looks like there's cigarettes. The room's cold enough without opening the window. Can't push it. I guess I can't block An old my door. Wardrobe. No. No, Marky Mark. I'm not adding Superman 64 to my horror marathon. How dare you? This is a whole new area over here, right? There's a million doors. It's locked. I'm gonna assume they're all gonna be locked. <clears throat> it won't open. There's a girl crying, hear that? Nothing of interest here. Nowhere to save? It's late. I don't think it'd be wise to wake the other guests. It's late. I don't think it'd be wise to wake the other guests. It looks like I can move this eventually, but they're not letting me do it right now. It's always good when you rent a hotel room and there's a broken window and glass all over the floor next to your bed. I wish there was somewhere to save. Mm -hmm. 
I can't sleep here. It's not my room. No, it's not. Why are the rooms connected? This is weird. It's too heavy to move. It's too connected rooms like a suite. Problem is, there's no way to lock the door going to the connecting room, right? All right, well. I just don't feel safe going to sleep yet. Then what do I do? A broken light bulb. I see no reason to open it right now. I can't see anything. I don't know where to go. Uh. I just don't feel safe going to sleep yet. What the hell do I do? Oh. So doors you can bullet on one side, actionable to unlock or lock the door, and they're useful in escaping enemies. Wait, okay, but I locked it. I don't know what to do. Wardrobe. What? Yeah, okay, well, let me move this. Ugh. I just don't feel safe going to sleep yet. What to do here, and the game won't save, and I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. I just don't feel safe going to sleep yet. Better, not exactly safe. Wow, but the best I'm gonna get in this infernal town. So I can lock my door and the door next door. Elizabeth turned out to be more dilapidated, depressed, and unwelcoming than initially expected. The stench of rotten fish fills the air, while poverty and disease lie festering in every cobbled back street. Only a few of the inhabitants have been at all cooperative. The others are evasive and sometimes downright hostile. My detective's instinct tells me they're trying to hide something. Of course, I could simply be prejudiced by their look and manners. They're almost ugly enough to get me believing those local tales of the Innsmouth taint. Even so, I've been able to make some progress. <clears throat> Finding Ruth Billingham was a lucky break. She's convinced Loverboy is still in one piece and being held in the town jailhouse. Rebecca Lawrence is clearly afraid of something. She doesn't come across as the type that scares easily, but then I guess she's not afraid enough to leave. She seems more worried about me. Then there's Zadok Allen, the old rummy. He was willing to talk all right. I wish I knew whether he turned to drink because of what he saw or whether he saw things because he was drinking. The Order of Dagon, uh, some heathen religion brought back from the South Seas by Obed Marsh, Rituals on Devil's Reef. Those wouldn't join massacred by some kind of monsters in 1846. It's also far-fetched. But what else could explain the thing that charged out from Thomas Waits' attic? If I hadn't spoken with Thomas himself, I'm sure I was seeing things. Whatever really is going on, the place gives me the creeps. The dreams are becoming stronger. I seem to spend each night in weird, fantastic landscapes with immense buildings and no architecture I've ever seen. And my body in the dreams is so strange I can't begin to describe it. Maybe I'm some buried memory of all the occult stuff I studied when I wasn't myself. And this spooky vision thing is acting up worse than ever. Used to be. But I could kind of see what people were thinking sometimes. But now it's going crazy. Like someone's watching me all the time. Tracking me from the rooftops and the shadows. I'm so edgy I can hardly think straight. If only I could get some decent bourbon in this miserable town. I need to track down Brian Burnham. And fast. The sooner I get out of here the better. I'll make an early start in the morning. There you go. Saving the game. Okay, good. Oh. Oh. The Great 
great city of Nakotas. Rest now, Jack. You are safe. Uh... What? What was in the light, Jack? <laughs> Where do you want to go? What's going on? We are your history, Jack. And your future. I don't understand. You will, in time. Dillman, where have you put the outsider? Top of the house, room 401. Come on, let's have it. They're coming for me. Okay. Attack of the Fishermen. Oh, Attack of the Fishmen, excuse me. I thought it said Fishermen, it's the Fishmen. It's only guess they're trying to get in. Ladders in room. Just keep the noise down. Here, take the keys. Curses. <laughs> it's locked. Probably bolted. Side. He's awake in there. I can hear him moving about. Break the door down, you damn fool. Quick! I see them heading down. Check. This is taking too long. I've got to slow them down first. 